One of the most common supplements that you'll find in any drugstore or even in your own home is omega-3 supplements. Omega-3 supplements have been in the market for many years now and it's been touted to help not only your heart, but at the same time, other parts of your body as well. Now in this video, we'll be exploring the benefits of omega-3 for your skin's health and how it can actually increase your skin's health and allow you to get a nice glowing skin. However, before we continue with the video, ladies and gentlemen, just help click the subscribe button because it helps push videos like this to more people like yourself. Great day, ladies and gentlemen, I'm Dr. Inky, your digital skin doctor, and welcome to SkinFix, the platform whereby we help you find the best things for your skin. Now in this video, I'll be discussing with you six key benefits of Omega-3 for your skin and how it can help you achieve that perfect looking skin. Now first up, let's discuss what is Omega-3 in the first place. Now Omega-3 is one of two polyunsaturated fatty acids. So for polyunsaturated fatty acids, there are two types, generally the Omega-3 and Omega-6. However, in this video, we'll be only discussing regarding Omega-3. Omega-3 fatty acids are naturally found in your food, primarily in fish, things like salmon and mackerel. It can be also found in nuts like chia seed and flax seed. It is also naturally found in plant oils, things like soybean and canola oil. Omega-3 has multiple health benefits and the primary one that a lot of us need from Omega-3 is actually to reduce inflammation. There are also clinical studies that show that it also improves your eye's health, reduce depression, and at the same time, improve your anxiety. Now in this video, we won't be discussing about all those key benefits. Instead, we'll be discussing about the key benefits for your skin. Here are six ways Omega-3 can help with your skin. Number six, it helps protect your skin against sun damage. Now, Omega-3 has been shown to reduce your skin's photosensitivity against sun. It means if you're someone that suffers from sun rash or even sunburns, Omega-3 can help reduce the incidence of those particular issues. In this clinical study, it shows that Omega-3 is a promising candidate to help protect your skin against UV damage. So all the more reason to load up on that Omega-3. Number five, it's been shown to reduce acne. One of the primary effects of acne on your skin is that there's actually a lot of inflammation inside your pores. And inflammation can lead to even more damage, lead to even worse scarring. Now, in this particular clinical study, it shows that by taking high levels of omega-3, it helps reduce the amount of inflammation in your skin. Now, the lesser the inflammation, the lesser the acne, and the quicker the acne can actually heal. It also shows that when paired together with a low GI or glycemic index food, means food that does not contain high levels of sugar or carbohydrate, it actually speeds up your acne's recovery or your skin's recovery when you're suffering from acne. Now, before we proceed to number four, let me in the comments below how much omega-3 you need to take on a daily basis in milligrams. Number four, omega-3 may guard your skin against dry, itchy skin. Now, one of the key functions of omega-3 is to reduce inflammation. However, omega-3 can also help partially moisturize your skin. That means that long-term use of omega-3 can actually help repair your skin's barrier, make sure your skin is well hydrated, and at the same time, if you're suffering from a chronic inflammatory skin disease, something like eczema or psoriasis, omega-3 can reduce the incidence of chronic skin disorders. Now here, there are three clinical studies which shows that omega-3 has a role in protecting your skin against those dry, nasty, chronic skin issues. However, more clinical study needs to be done to show that omega-3 has a direct improvement on your skin. Now, this particular clinical study shows it helps reduce dry skin and help reduce the incidence of atomic dermatitis. And in this particular study, it shows that it actually improves the incidence or the outcome of psoriasis. And in this one clinical study, it shows that it actually improves skin barrier. Number three, it may accelerate wound healing. For someone suffering from diabetes, venous ulcers can be a regular occurrence that happens in the lower limbs. More often than not, there's pooling of blood and fluid in the lower limbs causing extra vascular damage. And in someone who is diabetic, there is always delayed wound healing. Now in this particular clinical study, it shows that by taking omega-3, it actually accelerates wound healing. Theoretically, the way it works is that omega-3 actually activates the immune system which helps fight against those bacteria which is attacking your skin. And the more bacteria you have in your skin, the slower the wound healing. 
Omega-3 also helps balance out your skin's microbiome. And your skin's microbiome is responsible for repairing the skin barrier and maintaining your skin's health. On top of that, there are other theories as well, whereby Omega-3 actually alters the DNA or I would say improves the DNA of the skin cells and hence making it more resilient to damage. Number two, it may reduce the risk of skin cancer. Now, this particular portion of the function of omega-3 can be contended because skin cancer happens because of many different factors. Factors due to genetic, sun exposure, or even your environment. However, there are clinical studies that shows that by taking high levels of omega-3, it does help reduce incidence of squamous cell carcinoma and melanomas. Now, they have done this particular study in both animal trials and in humans as well. However, it does not mean that omega-3 can actually protect your skin 100% from any sort of skin cancer. You still need to take a lot of precautions. And the number one benefit of omega-3, it helps grow your hair. Balding or hair loss is actually a major problem in many parts of the world. Both females and males alike suffer from hair loss. Now, up to now, majority of hair loss issues are treated with medications like minoxidil and finasteride. However, most of the time, drugs itself only contribute to a portion of healthier hair. Now, one way to actually slow down hair loss is actually to take omega-3 supplements. And the way it is been posturized to actually help your hair growth is that omega-3 boosts the growing phase of your hair. Now, your hair has two different phases, a growing phase and a resting phase. Now, most of the time, you lose hair because the hair stays in the resting phase for too long. So the way to grow your hair is actually to convert the resting hair back into growing hair. And omega-3 has a role to play by converting your hairs into growing hairs. And if you're someone suffering from hair loss, very mild hair loss, you can actually start taking omega-3 supplements. But however, if your hair loss do persist and gets worse, please go and see your dermatologist. So there we have it, ladies and gentlemen, six reasons why you should be taking omega-3 because it helps your hair and your skin. If you found this video useful, please like, subscribe, and at the same time, forward this video to your family and friends. Let me know in the comments below what are the benefits of Omega-3 that I have missed, and I might cover that in the next video. Do not forget to turn on the bell button because we release new videos on a weekly basis. That's it from me. I'm Dr. Inky, your digital skin doctor, and always remember to stay safe, stay healthy, and most importantly, stay informed.